Hey, music junkies, professor of rock, always here to celebrate greatest artists and songs of all time. First of all, please subscribe. Help us build this channel, keep the music alive. Now, this is a new and quick segment that we're going to call the Professor's Notes, where I'm going to share a quick thought on pop music. So the other day, I was on my commute home. I was listening to music, of course, and listening to a classic rock playlist, and More Than a Feeling by Boston came on. I mean, that's a song that I've heard a thousand times, and that we're certainly going to cover in more depth in the future. Just incredible. But anyway, I was thinking about lead singer Brad Delp, a guy that's knocked me out too many times to count. I mean, he's one of the most criminally underrated vocalists of the rock era. Whenever people talk about the greatest rock vocalists of all time, conversation always evolves around the same people. You know, people like Robert Plant from Led Zeppelin, Freddie Mercury of Queen, Ann Wilson of Heart, Steve Perry of Journey, Roger Daltrey of The Who, Janis Joplin, and of course, for good reason, they're all incredible. But how Brad Delp isn't in that conversation more consistently, it's a bit borderline insane. I mean, his master of the upper range of the human voice is almost unrivaled. But the thing is, he could sustain it for long periods of time without any loss of power. Go back and listen to that perfection in More Than a Feeling and tell me that I'm wrong. Or go listen to a, a ballad like Amanda or Let Me Take You Home Tonight where he delivers a, a beautifully tender vocal with as much purity as any other singer on their best day. Now, I've talked to people who knew Brad Delp, including my producing partner, who coincidentally co-produced his last live performance. And Brad Delp has been described as a, a sweet soul, very humble, down to earth, unaffected. So you know what? Let's celebrate Brad Delp today as one of the greatest of all time by listening to some of his greatest vocal performances, which we've included in the description below, Spotify playlist or here on YouTube. Leave a comment, share your thoughts on Brad and your favorite Boston songs and why below. Also, hit that subscribe button. Help us build this community and keep the greatest music alive. Until next time, three chords and the truth, my friends. Mm -hmm.